first impression was uh, it looks like a zebra kind of like design, which I really like. And I know that it ran in the past, so to erase it for the first time, um, I'm really excited to, to do it under the lights. It has also a bit of shine to it, um, like glittery, so it's a, it's a nice touch and yeah, I'm excited to, to drive it. Yeah, it feels really special uh, to, to drive this livery. Um, it's a historical moment to, to race it on track and also as part of the F1 Academy grid. It's uh, as a girl as well. It's uh, nice to run it and yeah, I'm just excited to get on track under the lights and see how it looks and I can't wait to get the images afterwards as well. <laughs> yeah, first time racing in Singapore. Uh, I'm really excited. It's such a technical circuit. Uh, a lot of corners. So yeah, I'm excited to get out there. We have one practice session, so you know, it's all about adapting and pushing and uh, trying to see the limits here at, uh, on the street circuits. It's perfect, it's perfect. It's just how I imagined it. So when I was uh, about to design the car, I wanted it to have something to do with Singaporean culture. So I started to look for, you know, the traditional clothes and artists and whatever. And I found this particular Singaporean artist called Tan Suye Hian. I'm sorry, I don't think I pronounced that correctly. Um, but basically he worked with um, calligraphy on top of like a beige uh, background. And the calligraphy was trying to um, mix both the traditional aspect of it and at the same time the freedom of modern art. So when I was designing the car, I wanted to keep two aspects, the traditional aspect and the freedom of modern art. So for traditional, I wanted the blue iconic, the iconic blue of the Red Bull car, which I kept. And then for the more freedom of modern art aspect, uh, the lines. At, at first, I wanted them to be black so they could be the same color as the ink in this artist's art. Um, but then I knew that it wouldn't look good because the blue is so dark. So um, I made it white and it looked pretty good. Already having seen it here is amazing and to see it race, I mean, I just can't wait. And I hope the fans love it as much as I do. Oh yeah, absolutely. I mean, as a woman, to see a woman race in the car I designed. I mean, and I also follow Hamda and the F1 Academy girls on Instagram. So I, I don't know, I feel like in some level I know them and to see somebody that I've seen before, you know, on my screen racing my car, it's just such a special feeling, to be honest. 